Hello, Barry Anderson here from Trade Ideas with the Trade of the Day, and today it is SYTA, a very low float. Uh, I think it's got about three million in the float or so. Um, this uh, popped into our scan uh, before the market opened. This is the pre-market action. You can see it was at around three dollars. Uh, closed yesterday at around 269, and then it just really started to move. And I guess I had some kind of a contract. Uh, $1.6 million contract. It's a very low float, Canadian company. Uh, for the while in the pre-market, it really wasn't doing too much. You, I mean, it, it, it was pretty erratic. It was up to five, back down to four, and really not doing too much. And then the market opened. Here's their 9.30, 15-minute candle, and it just took off. Now, I traded this one a couple of times, okay? Um, you know, I got in, in over six and it popped up to uh, 673. The 200 day moving average, I think was 678 or 683. And that's what kind of stalled it. And that's what got me out. And then when it popped over that 200 day moving average, I got back in. Uh, it wasn't easy, um, you know, got over 720. I was, I, you know, we, we preach in the room about having to manage your trades, especially when you're talking about something that is such a low float anything can happen and you can see that's exactly what happened i mean look at this big red candle wiping all this out now it's trying to come back a little bit but that red candle wiped everything out way down below that 200 day and you know i don't know where this is going to go from uh, from now uh, to the end of the day but you know if it takes out that 200 day again because if you look left if i just bring out a time frame uh let's say a daily chart you can see, you can kind of see the next high, actually that the daily chart doesn't do it justice. I better bring up the weekly chart. There we go. So the next highs are up in this le level here. You know, I actually, yeah, around that seven to eight level. So, I mean, it has a shot to get up here uh, if it can take out the 200 day moving average again. But anyway, I mean, they're fun to trade. They're fantastic to trade when they're moving up, but you know, as I say in the room all the time, you cannot wander away from your computer thinking, for instance, oh yeah, it's over seven and look what it did. I guess it's going to be okay. I'm going to go downstairs, make a cup of coffee, come back up. This is exactly what can happen. So you cannot leave your computer when you're in a low flow. All right, I want to get back into the room. So I'm going to shut this down. And if you have any questions for me, this is the um, email address you can use. Um, the room is actually, I keep saying it, I'll probably change it from the weekend. Uh, the room is open from 8 a.m. now, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Eastern Time. So hope to see you in the room tomorrow. Bye-bye.